So across the ferry house now then on a globe trotting day three. And this is a two mile three foot on maiden. And at the top we've got Dante for Martin Leedham. Far oh, fairway for Kevin Minahan. Here's a newcomer, San Jose Secret for Vinnie Gerard, Jazzy Lady, Graham Clutterbuck, Ozark set in Vinnie Gerard, Seductress Paul Rhodes, Wash and Go for Obi Wan, and Yearbook Leggings for Ben Bonici. There's so just eight in this then. A two mile three furlong hurdle, and away they go. With Wash and Go. Just the first to show. From Yearbook Leggings on the inside in second. in third as they get to the first of the ten they've got to take in this and they're all safely over that one with a year more leggings in the lead by about a length but they're being joined by wash and go the yellow jacketed wash and go looks like it wants to go on into the leads uh seductress is back in third then comes fairway with dante in the purple jacket on the inside just about fifth then comes Jazzy Lady and Ozark setting and San Jose Secret. So Vinnie Gerard's got the back two at this point. They make their way towards the second flight. Which they're all over safe and yearbook leggings jump back into a clear lead there. Leads by a length and a half to wash and goes again. Driven up on the flat to move along the sides. Well, let's see what happens at the next flight. Where the yearbook leggings can regain a clear lead with a better leap. And he did. And the yearbook leggings leads by two again to wash and go and seductress dante on the inside is taking closer order in the gray fairway bit of a gap back to the vinnie gerard pair ozark setting and san jose secret who have gone past graham clutterbox jazzy lady who is now the back marker on his yearbook leggings for ben bonici half a length up as they get to the fourth wash and go for serious chill in second then comes Seductress in third, and Fairways after that, Dante's next, and now Wash and Go's gone on again, by about a neck, as they race down towards the next, Wash and Go, Yearbook Leggings, Seductress, Dante and Fairway, then the back three in a line as they take number five, and Wash and Go, could jump on the outside there, by Ozark setting, but they're pretty tightly grouped, this is going to be a competitive finish by the looks of things, and they've still got well over a mile and a quarter still to go though, and it's wash and go in the lead. From yearbook leggings in second, Dante third, Seductress four and San Jose Secret five. Then the Grey Fairway is just between them with Jazzy Lady and Ozark setting at the back. Overall eight lengths first to last, and it's a wash and go. Continues to show the way. With yearbook leggings second, Seductress on the outside third. Dante between them as they take number six. Looks they're all over safely again. One or two gave it a bit of air, but all got over it fine. And Wash and Go continues to be the leader. Seductress is second. Yearbook Leggings on the inside is third, and Dante on that one's outside is fourth. And in comes San Jose Secret and Ozark setting fairway, just dropped back a little bit. Well, he's probably actually closer to the lead now than he was when he was in fourth as the field are really beginning to tighten. Good jump there by Yearbook Leggings. Seeing that one get back into the lead. And leads by about half a length. But now Wash and Go being driven up again on the inside. And an interesting jockey move there from the um, Paul Rhodes horse. The Ducks has virtually run that horse into a into a cul-de-sac, really. He was he got plenty of clear room on the outside. He stuck it into the rail and almost got boxed in. But now he's pulled out again. We're looking for a bit of a run, but Washing goes in the lead. Washing goes in front. Dante's now the one who's trapped on the inside, but it's Washing go over the eighth. Oh, and there's a mistake there. It's a duck that's just gone, and it does make you wonder if that horse had its concentration affected by the jockey manoeuvre. But it's now Ozark setting who's come through to take it up. It's Ozark setting takes it up from Washing go. Jazzy ladies come from nowhere. Fairway running a big race on debut. Get back to Dante and San Jose Secret and Yearbook Leggings who look beaten. It's Ozark setting. Setting in two furlongs to go and two flights to take. Ozark setting in the lead. Jazzy Lady over the second as they go. Fairway over it in third. Wash and go trying to come back in fourth. But it's Ozark setting who's clear with a furlong to go and one flight to take. Ozark setting is in front being chased by Jazzy Lady and Fairway. Ozark setting still in the lead coming out towards his final flight. It's only a short run. He pops over it. Jazzy Lady and Fairway jumping better. Fairway's trying to close. Ozark setting's holding on. Fairway and Jazzy Lady flashing at the line, but it's just Ozark setting in on to take it. Ozark setting takes it for Vinnie Gerard touched off over at Far Hills with this time he hung on. And 
good run for Fairway for Kevin Minahan back in the league after a break. And Jazzy Lady also in. Actually got up to take second. And Dante was a big disappointment there. That one got some decent form from earlier in the season. But it's Ozark setting that takes it for Vinnie Gerard. Jazzy Lady for Graham Clutterbuck second. Fairway for Kevin Minahan a good third. San Jose Secret for Vinnie Gerard was fourth. And Dante was fifth. 